Look, we have seen um, treatment requests for patients with molybdenum cofactor deficiency, most of them unfortunately in an advanced age with very severe damage, um, coming from all over the world. So I don't think that there is a specific geographic ethnicity um, that has a per se higher incidence of this condition. It is seen all over the world. As in every metabolic disease and as in every inborn error of metabolism, um, there's always a higher rate in areas where you have a lot of consanguity. Um, so if that might give you a hint to suspect an inborn error of metabolism in general. Um, I think that if you have a family history of early neonatal deaths or severely disabled babies, if you have any siblings um, that had the typical late presentation in MRI, which is cystic degradation of the subcortical white matter, a brain that really looks completely riddled with big cystic holes in it, um, that would give you very strong um, suspicion that this might be molybdenum cofactor deficiency. In fact, the best treatment results, and because of the earliest onset, we always get in families where already a previous sibling was diagnosed with a disease because those are the cases where you can do in utero diagnosis by amniocentesis or other ways to, to diagnose a baby before it is born and then have everything ready when the baby is actually delivered.